Greetings YouTube, this is Taladin, and I am doing my very first YouTube video. Uh, it's going to be a mixture of kind of a let's play and some of the tutorial style videos. If you're familiar with Paul Soros Jr., I suggest you go check his channel out. Uh, he is extremely talented with doing tutorials and how-to's and survival tips and things like that. Today I'm going to be going through and just basically getting set up. Uh, bear with me, I am learning still how to do the videos uh, and if I seem unprofessional or whatever, um, just mark it up to noob experience. Um, this is going to be kind of a let's play kind of thing, so I will be doing some drudgery tasks while I'm talking to you about Minecraft. Um, but hopefully uh, it will help some of you out there who have not had much experience with Minecraft, or even if you have had experience with Minecraft, uh, it will give you kind of a different perspective. Uh, and I'm getting a little bit of lag here because I'm recording, um, so just bear with me. Um, and this is a relatively new world that I have created. Uh, I had a big world set up with a... Uh, I was using the Glacier Seed, and I am also now using the Glacier Seed again. Um, However, I ended up losing it all in a crash, so that's the first thing that uh, I want to touch on, is make sure you back up your Minecraft saves. Um, I'm not going to go into how to do that right now. There's plenty of tutorials online that show you how to back up your Minecraft worlds uh, and your saves, but um, that's something that you definitely want to do, especially after you've had time to go through and really uh, build up some structures. If you're a creative builder or if you're a survival player, then you want to, after you've logged so many hours, you definitely don't want to lose the things that you've done. And I'm kind of a mix between the creative and the survival. I like the survival mode, um, but I also like to build things and I'm interested in several of the different mods out there. Um, I do use uh, a few mods. Um, Industrial Craft is one of the main mods that I use. Uh, I also use Build Craft, which uh, kind of fits hand in glove with the idea of Industrial Craft. Um, but it is uh, very interesting to be able to do things other than just normal mining and you know doing furnace work and things like that. Um, some of you may not be interested in industrial craft or build craft and if not that's fine. Uh, those of you who are I intend on exploring uh, the industrial craft and the build craft mods. Um, let's turn the music down a little bit. Uh, intend on exploring some of the things that um, those mods have available to them and uh, maybe helping some people learn how to uh, use those mods to the best of their abilities. Um, I do have some unique ideas on uh, you know how I play Minecraft uh, at least I think they're unique, at least I've never heard of anybody in in the videos going over some of the things that I think about and consider while I'm playing. Um, and I will touch on those. This is just sort of my introductory video. And I would like...